Welcome to Ancestral Health Today, evolutionary insights into modern health. Welcome everybody. We are so excited to have you here today. This is the Ancestral Health Today podcast, the official podcast of the Ancestral Health Society. And I am your co-host, Isabel Burnett. And I'm your other co-host, Todd Becker. And Todd, can we tell the audience how we got into Ancestral Health? Sure, Isabel. My first experience was attending the 2012 Ancestral Health Symposium at Harvard. That was the second one. I missed the first one, but I've been to every conference ever since. I've spoken at many of them, and now I'm ex excited to join you as co-host of this podcast. Absolutely. And I had been implementing Ancestral Health Principles since 2018 and found the Ancestral Health Symposium in 2000. 21, and I have attended the symposiums after and have been involved as well because this has been so beneficial for my own health and it's rooted in scientific information with amazing guests. That's right. And we'll talk a little bit about some of the guests that we've already recorded episodes with. Now, a lot of people come to AHS and ancestral health through their own health challenges. Some people are more interested in just optimizing their health or they're interested in the basic science. So we've recorded episodes with experts in their field, you know, academics, uh, people who are health coaches, and even ordinary uh, practitioners uh, who have applied some of these principles to their lives. So, so far, I can tell you a few of the exciting episodes that I've recorded. One of them is with James Nestor, who's an expert on breathing. I have another episode with Michael Rose, who's an evolutionary biologist, who talks about how evolution can give us insights into longevity. And another great episode with Stephen Guionet, who's talked about the brain's role in regulating eating and appetite. And a really interesting one with Terry Walls, who spoke at actually the 2012 AHS on multiple sclerosis and how to overcome that through dietary practices. And she's really advanced the science and, and the practice since then. And then we just did a, a joint interview with another luminary in the ancestral health field. Do you want to talk about that one, Isabel? Yes, absolutely. So our first episode will, will be a two-part episode with Daryl Edwards, and he will be talking about um, movement and play, as well as the 12 pillars of health. So you do not want to miss that episode. We will also have guests such as Dr. Alessio Fasano, and Dr. Alessio Fasano is an expert and pioneer in working on the microbiome. Also, Katie Bowman, who will be talking about movement, and Jen Brea, who will be talking to us about MECFS. The podcast launches September 5th, and you will have an opportunity to listen to an episode every Tuesday afternoon. That's great. We also have a launch party, a live launch party scheduled on October 1st, where we'll have some of our guests dropping in and you'll have an opportunity live to join us and take part in the conversation. Uh, you mentioned the subscriptions on Substack. Uh, Isabel, can you tell our audience what benefits come with being a subscriber? Yes, absolutely. So the podcast will be released through Substack. And you can follow and subscribe um, on there to see when each episode is coming out and to get information on every guest. But if you also support us on Substack, you'll be able to get bonus episodes. You'll be able to have live interviews with guests and also sending questions that we can ask us ahead of time and answer whatever you want to know. Great. So Ancestral Health Society has been around for more than a decade, we've had the conference, we have a journal, and now we've got Ancestral Health Today, this great new podcast. Uh, we hope you can join us as part of the conversation. Look forward to seeing you on the podcast. Yes, absolutely. We'll be glad to be in your ears every single week and to bring you amazing scientific information that will help you with your health journey and to get to know Ancestral Health a little bit more and apply it to your life today. Thank you for being here today. 
We will have the links in the show notes and we look forward to listening to your feedback as well. Thanks for joining us on this episode of Ancestral Health Today. We hope you enjoyed our discussion on how evolutionary insights can inform modern health practices. Be sure to subscribe to our podcast to catch future episodes.